guys welcome to wrong. today's video today we're starting out on our truck shopping journey i know you guys probably don't care about us trying trucks but we are trying trucks and we're taking you guys with us today on the agenda is a blue truck are we looking at a blue truck yeah and it is not a dodge i never thought i'd see the day that sam doesn't buy a dodge but let's go see it's fortunately a ford let's go look at a ford you guys it is a ford it is blue but looks black it's definitely not blue is it blue it is super cute i like it brown inside i'm not in love with the brown but this is a farm truck why why we don't know if it's the right truck oh it doesn't look like yeah i know that's what i said too whoops let's close the door quick oh i'm sorry so the truck it better not be in kingston then so they like this we're not going back to and this oh my gosh if that's the truth i'll lose my mind sam like called it. the guy and said like hey we want to look at this truck and he's like yeah sure and we followed the the directions an hour away and then we messaged the guy and said we're here and he's like oh that's not where the truck is it's another hour away so we drove where's he going Just double checking because that's the picture she showed me of that truck but that's not the truck i wanted Oh my gosh. We're not going back to camp. So basically we just drove two hours and back and it. forth because the guy said that the truck was at a different lot. And where is he going to check? Just checking whatever he has to check. Can we go look at the turtles? Yeah, let's go. Way? Let's go look at the turtles. Well, while we wait for that guy to figure out his stuff, like, is that not a sign though? Like if the guy can't even keep track of what truck we're coming to see and where it's located so you can barely see them there's turtles on that rock over there oh and there's swans oh, over there oh my gosh and then there's swans down there and this property is for sale uh, i don't know i like it all right so that was a joke that was ridiculous i don't even understand that that was the stupidest thing the truck wasn't even in kingston either the truck they don't even like where i don't know anyway to make a long story short, we're not getting this truck. Not today, anyways. They don't even have it here. The guy, like, this company is so mixed up. They sent us on this wild goose chase to look at this truck, and then when we finally ended up where we needed to be, the truck isn't even here. But he can get it and bring it here. I'm like, yeah, I'll believe it when I see it. So, everything happens for a reason, though. Like, I always have to keep reminding myself. Yep, no Fords. No yeah. Fords. Well, we found swans. We, thought, we found swans and turtles, and that's a great way to start our our day. But everything happens for a reason. Like, like that's a nice truck they showed me, but that's yeah. not the truck. I was that is. For. That was such a nice truck. You get that one instead. Sam is freezing water for tomorrow. We are making lunches. Do you guys make lunches when you go to horse shows? I don't even know if I told you guys we're going to a horse show. We are going to a horse show. One of my favorite things that I've been eating a lot of lately are these grapes. They're called, I think I showed you guys, they're called candy store grapes. And they look like this. Oh my gosh, they're so good. They're the best grapes. I can't even stop myself from eating them. I like to have a lot of fruit because I get low blood sugar on occasion. It's a lot better now. But I like to have it because it's super easy to just grab it. And my favorite fruit of all is pink grapefruit i love that stuff sometimes i hit the dollar section or the two dollar section and i buy fruit like this because i know our chickens would love it and sometimes i buy apples there for our horses or bananas and i got these as well for the chickens but we do make our own lunches with like we make sandwiches or buns it is show prep day and we have a lot to prep like we haven't Shown, Gabby hasn't shown for a while, like really shown. So we have a lot to uh, organize and get ready. What do you want me to sit? I need to find her saddle pad. Okay, sit down there. Oh, I'm tired. Yeah, me it's too. It's really hot, so it makes you more tired when you walk Well, stop bed. wearing a hoodie. I only wear sweaters. Oh, see, that's what happens when you have an older sister that does that. No, they're the comfiest. They're <laughs> just like, we. I'm in a good mood today. You're in a good mood every day. So when I ordered all this stuff for our polymer clay, I also, like I ordered this as well. I ordered these things so that we can make jewelry and make shapes and stuff. Like, have you guys seen the rainbows that people are making right now? They're huge. I'd love to make a rainbow necklace. And then inside here we have like the shapes for jewelry. 
for inside one of these. And then it had like all the jewelry things that you can make jewelry out of the clay. More stuff for jewelry. Some little, I don't even know what all this is. Some more tools. But anyway, that's what we got. More stuff for the clay. The girls have really been loving that clay. I have been loving it more. But Gabby loves it too. I She's like been it doing more. it a lot. Yeah, but we really, really like it. It's been this, so fun. I think it's going to be good for like shaping stuff. Oh, do you know what that's for? It's for when you cut out a bunch of shapes on one piece of clay and then you need to like pick up all the, like you need to pick up around the cutouts. That's cool mm -hmm. though. It's nice. We need to get some kind of container, need, storage container to put all of our polymer clay and stuff then in. This. I see us going deeper into polymer clay. Well, hello, Macy. <laughs> Anyway, let's get to show prep. Gabby's down with Sam and she's doing Chino's yes. stall. She just took Another him out this morning because we had to go to look at the truck that was non-existent. And Another thing that you can use to cut the clay. So she's doing his uh, stall and then we're going to get oh. ready and we're going to get packed up for the show. We have one of these but bigger and I used it to make the things for the pumpkin. So today when we got back Sam and Gabby went to vacuum out. Wow, I've hardly been doing anything. Gabby's been packing up everything herself. So anyway, they vacuumed out the van. They took it to like the car wash, vacuumed it out. Looks like it could still use some vacuuming. <laughs> anyway, do you have everything, Gabby? We're just missing the cooler. Missing the cooler? Wow, you guys, I hardly did any of this. I'm impressed. So we also have these chairs. These are in the back of... Gabby's car and I'm bringing one of these because these are the comfy chairs. Can you bring the other one? No, I think it's your dad's. Is it mine? Yeah, it's dad's. If I had a heated sweater, I'd never let it out of my sight. Gabby's like, who's putting all this stuff in my trunk? Vacuum. Yeah, Gabby's in a cleaning mood. So the last thing I have to do is wash Gabby's saddle pad and we need to get our clothes and stuff ready. Okay, go ahead. Pack it in there. Gabby, this is Sophie's blanket. Yeah. And your dad's sweater. We are ready though and I hardly did anything. Can't believe we're at this stage where Gabby packed everything. Do you know where your clothes are? Like your riding pants and stuff? Do you guys remember when Gabby had those big huge black marks on that on her saddle pad from her boots? On this side too. She had it on both sides. And I, you can see it a little bit down there. I got it out, you guys. I used that pink stuff that I got in the uh, from the mall the last time we were there. Remember that jar of pink stuff? I used it and it gets stuff out. Like it gets the job done. I have to look for bug spray because Gabby said she didn't pack it. This is literally like her first show on her own, packing on her own. And I don't, and I love that. Like this is what she's gonna end up doing eventually. Oh, I found it, I think. No, that's not it. Is this it? I don't think this is it. It makes me nervous because I'm like, I worry about that kind of stuff. And you know, the more I'm not in the barn, the messier it gets. I don't know how that happens, but I need to find bug spray. It's going to be like a shock when we get to the show and I see what's there. Normally I'm the one that packs everything and now Gabby's doing it herself. Hi. Elizabeth is in the barn. She always is. She's always here. All right. What the heck, man? I literally have two things of bug spray and I can't find any of them. Hello, lovely lady. Hello. You ready for supper? People are saying that Gabby keeps forgetting to do up her clip. I keep reminding her. Oh. Sophie does hers up. What is wrong with you? It's a lot that she just doesn't think of it because she's only going like 10 feet and she just she doesn't think that the risk is too high. I just heard a big, huge... Winnie from Chino. He's like, where, 
Where are my girls? Yeah, Tino and Willow are the bomb. They're the they're the ones. But as you can see, Gabby has it all done up today. Oh, Penny is excited. <laughs> Whoa, what are you doing? <laughs> you love her? Uh-oh. Trouble. What the heck? Uh-oh. Whoa. I don't know. Wow, look at her! Did you guys see that? She was ready to square off. Yep, there she goes. So this doesn't ever happen. It's always quiet in the horse field. It was Gracie that caused that problem. <laughs> but you see Penny took her mini. <laughs> Get going, you little mini. No playing with boys. <laughs> that was terrifying. <laughs> Like he should be able to have a mini if he wants a mini. That's his, uh oh. I don't know, maybe they're vying for, for leadership now. I've been all around the world. Every city, every place. Always been a restless girl. But now there's I'm actually shocked that he po he picked Willow. Actually, I'm not shocked he picked Willow. Willow's a good friend. She like idolizes. She always picks somebody to idolize. So I cleaned this bottle. I couldn't find the bug spray. I think it's in the van, to be honest. I need to like this. I need to get all of our stuff together. I keep saying it. In the yeah, it's empty. This is different bug spray. No, I like these little ones that I can see better. This stuff works so good. I know in the past I complained about spending like 70 bucks on a little bottle of bug spray that's, that is messy and you're supposed to wipe it on. In the end, I put it in a squirt bottle. They say not to do that. I did it. It works good for me. And the truth is this stuff works so good. Like I would buy it again. And one little bottle has lasted me all season so far. So I would buy it again. It's called Wipe, I think, if you're looking. It works really good in a spray bottle for the win. But anyway, I'm gonna go up there, clean up this spray bottle, see if I can get it all cleaned up. And then I'm gonna get ready. It is like 5 p.m. We are going to be waking up at 3 a.m. My son is gonna be able to be here tomorrow and take care of the dogs and the horses and the chickens, even though we will take them out and feed them and do chores and everything at three. Uh, he'll be here during the day, just to keep an eye on everything. We'll see you guys at the horse show. Like, this is the one that we haven't been able to go to for a really long time. It's the rated horse show that Gabby wanted to show at this year that we voted on with our barn and we're gonna finish out the year, even though we missed two shows. Actually, we missed three shows because we signed up late. <laughs> anyway, that is it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Wish us luck. We'll see you bright and early at 3 a.m. Don't you know that you're beautiful Just the